Hey, beautiful people. We are in these streets, about to make all our dreams come true. That's right. Yes, so I wanna do a wine tasting and I wanna take you along with me to pick up a few things. So I'm actually at Marshall's and sorry guys for the ads and everything, but it's hot out here. It's like 85 degrees and it, that's hot to us over here. Anyway, I'm at Marshall's. I'm gonna run in Marshall's really quickly and then I got two more stores to stop at and I'm taking you guys with me. So let's head into Marshall's and thank you for joining me on this video today. Before we get started, I do want to thank our sponsor, Bright Sellers. So thank you, Bright Sellers, for sponsoring today's video. I am just excited for another video for you guys to bring to bring y'all this content. So yeah, let's go into Marshalls. We got Marshalls, there's Nordstrom over there, Ulta. I really want to run into Ulta, but we ain't gonna make it into Ulta today. I'm on a mission. You know, sometimes you just gotta be focused. Focused, focused. So, head into Marshall's. Also, I just need some more setting spray. That's about it. I'm gonna have to show y'all my five minute morning makeup routine, guys. Literally, it really is five minutes and I'm not doing a whole lot, but you just look so put together and so ready for the day. Actually, this is Nordstrom Rack that's here in Saks Fifth Avenue. But anyway, let's go into Marshall's and see what they got. Really cute. Six piece makeup blenders. That's really cute. $5.99, it's not bad at all. And then we got Totally Plastic. Oh, how much is $5.99? Wish I could see the palette. Oh, this is by Iggy. Okay. Nice. Again, it's six color palette. Okay. And then purple platform that Iggy. This is $4.99. Totally plastic. It's only $4.99. And then they have a totally blue as well for $4.99. And look, they got Doja Cat Elements. Doja Cat Elements for $4.99. Okay, Doja. And Doja Cat Floral, Flora. How much is that? $4.99, nice. This is a Vonnie Gray Bay Station Vacation. Whoa, $7.99. This is a Morphe and a Vonnie Gray for $16.99. Look at this. This is nice. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get this. Yep. Consider it, guys. I also got this one. This is $19.99. This is also about Morphe in collaboration with Morphe. I'm gonna just sit that over there. And then I'm gonna put this back up here where I got it from. Well, okay. And then we have flower power. Mm, can't open that. Okay, there we go. That's only $4.99 as well. Not bad. Here's a Morphe. Dope Tope, $19.99. Just taking a quick look at their purses. I'm always looking at the shoes, just in case I can find like the twins, some all black shoes for school for next year. I'll just put them up, but I don't see any, even like these. If they had them in their size, I would buy these and put these up. These are Tom's. How much are they? They're on clearance for $11, $13. So not bad if they would have had them in their size. Even these right here. These are Hurley's. I don't see the size though. So I did find two pair in a three because they're really in a, still in a two right now. 
two and a half. So I'm gonna buy these and put these up. These are $20 a piece. So just put those up, call it a day. And then I'm just looking at the purses. This is on clearance for $1.99. And this is, I could see this from way back there that this was something expensive. I don't know what the V stands for. They got a little dust bag, Valentino, 200. And then we have a Steve Madden, Steve Madden. And this is $20. And we got these cute little purses right here. 18, look at that. These are 18, I have that one, I have this one, and there's that, okay. Yeah, that's all I'm seeing right here. This is cute. Davina Forenzi for Forenz, $60. This is different. So, these Steve Maddens are 20 Little bags. Got some more Steve Maddens for 20. These are really cute though. I love simple small purses. Again, when you're going somewhere and you don't want a huge purse. I like how that opens up too. They have an all black. silver detailing. I wish I had gold. And yeah, there's nothing else. $49.99 for this. And this is by Co. I like this. This is nice. This is nice. $50. This is nice. I wonder if the Yana would like something like that. Michael Kors bag. $25. And then they got a Michael Kors wristlet right here for $40. these bags. Steve Madden. I see the SM. I'm assuming it's Steve Madden. And these are 60. They're huge. They're nice too for 60. This is so cute. <laughs> this is just adorable to me. $24.99. That's really cute. Such a cute bag. So, where are you going on a little Got your little sundress on and everything. It's really cute. Okay, I'm just looking in this section to see if there's anything I can have on my charcuterie board. And it is. Okay. Yeah, I don't see anything that can go on the charcuterie board but it's okay just wanted to double check here go a couple more purses too this is a calvin klein book bag purse very nice and soft and this is 69.99 this is really nice and then we have michael kors right here oh it's kind of hard to show you because Here's the Michael Kors, $129, and then we have this one, $149.99. This one, let me see. I was looking for some more wine glasses, like stemless wine glasses, something like this. 
These are $12.99 for two. But they only have two. So they have the Rachel Zoe back here. Two stemless wine glasses. These are $9.99 for two. I love the way that looks in there. Love that. But they only have two. What am I gonna do with two? Gosh. Yeah. And then these are just water bottles. <laughs> You're my hero, a metal, $5.99. And then I think I'm gonna get this as one of the teacher gifts, plus a card and a gift card. And this one says, teach love, inspire, $5.99. So Kay can give her teacher one, her and Kensley can give her teacher one. These say best teacher ever. $8.99. Very nice. This is $20. Oh, teacher. Thoughtful, enthusiastic, active, caring, helpful, engaging, and revolutionary for $7.99. I love that you're my teacher. $5.99. So they have three. They have their art teacher, and their math and their reading teacher. Now I'm gonna run into Aldi. Just wanna pick up a few things for the charcuterie board. And then I think I'm gonna have to head to Dollar Tree really quickly. I wish they had gift cards in here. I might have to hit Target too for the gift cards. But first let me go on Aldi and get a few things out of here. As soon as you walk in, they have these baskets right here. So if you're looking for any baskets or anything, definitely check them out. I don't see, oh, uh, the large two pack $14.99. And then we have the large two pack $12.99. So not bad, not bad. And then these farm baskets $12.99. Look how cute this is for the kids. The little gardening sets are Mm, again, I don't see a price on it, but yeah, if you're looking for something like that, they do have it. So I'm going to grab some crackers, but I think I'm going to do some golden rounds, clubhouse, and the garden vegetable crackers. They have the panino tray, or yeah, they don't have any more prosciutto, but that's okay. The panino tray. I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna get me some dry salami. I think that'll be good. Your wine experience has arrived. Open a bottle to celebrate. Okay. How to maximize your wine experience. You're going to choose a bottle to try first. Pick something unfamiliar. It could be your favorite, your new favorite. Rate the wine as you drink. The more you rate, the more price, um, precise your matches will be. And that is exactly what I did with my last Bright Cellars box. So after I tasted the wines that I did taste, you go and you rate them and they match you. They try to match you again with something very similar. So they do give you wine wisdom okay and it just tells you gives you some information in here the serving temperature storing your wine using a corkscrew and so forth and then they give you cards on all of the different wines that they sent over which i absolutely love so let's open this really quickly So we have the cards that are that go with the wines, and we have apostate. We have cactus park, gladiolus, rising tail, color fast, 
and this one is forever fleeting and i love that the cards give you all of the information that you need on the wine let me give you a close up so for example with color fast it is a white blend it has peach white cherry honeydew and orange blossom 12.7 percent alcohol full bodied white you want to serve it at 50 to 55 degrees the pairings are passion fruit cheesecake spicy some type of spicy chicken weekend housework <laughs> that was a good one and then we have rising tail which is a cabernet and it's ripe and juicy this wine is fruit forward with flavors of blueberry and boysenberry complex notes of clove white pepper and sweet tobacco in, in the finish and it's blueberry boysenberry baking spices white pepper it has 13.3 percent alcohol medium bodied red you want to serve it in between 55 and 60 degrees fahrenheit you can pair it with cheese empanadas or dinner at a friend's house we have apostate and it has strawberry cherry raspberry and vanilla it's made it's a Zif it well, this Ziffindale is from Sonoma's Dry Creek Valley. It's deliciously ripe and fruity with notes of strawberry, cherry, and sweet vanilla bean. And you can pair it with um, frise salad with bacon, chicken and shrimp, and you can harvest seed or like a harvest season adventure, something like that. So as you can see, this one is from Chile. This one, no. This one is from California. This one is from Chile. This one is from California. This one is also from California. This one is from New World, California. And this one is from Lottie. I love that. I love that it tells you everything that's in it. The acidities, it tells you. This one even tells you the year, 2021. This one is a 2016. This one is a 2020. It tells you where it came from. And yes. I just love, love, love this. So let me tell you a little bit more about them. So Bright Cellars is a monthly wine club that matches you with wine that you'll love. So you take their, it's a seven question quiz and it's a palette quiz to see your personalized matches, which I really like because you get to determine if you want something a little sweeter, more tart or things like that. I personally prefer sweeter wines and I'm not opposed to the red wines or the white wines. Um, I like to try so that I can kind of figure out what I like more. I love that they give you the wine knowledge cards and the education cards and I'm learning as I'm enjoying the wine. It's telling me what is in there, how to serve it as far as temperature, what it pairs well with. These are things that I didn't know. I just knew that I enjoyed wine and I like to have a glass of wine every now and then. I'm not a, I have to have a glass of wine every single day type of person, but I do enjoy wine. I also love doing like wine tastings and things like that with my girlfriends. And that is what I was setting up here for them today. So just super simple and easy, but it's just a fun time. And we're getting to try some beautiful quality wines and I love it. They also help you determine how to, you know, open the wines and different things like that. So very, very nice, very nice. So also I wanted to mention that each box comes with, again, the education cards and you can rate them. You can go back onto the website and rate the wines and that way they can continue to pair you with wines that you're going to enjoy. The packaging is completely sustainable, is plastic free, and has a small carbon footprint, which is very nice for the universe or for the world right now. So that is always something that I enjoy. I know I can recycle that, which is nice. So I want to thank Bright Sellers for giving my followers a limited time offer of 50% off of your first six bottle box. All you have to do is click the link in the description box to get started. And it's super easy, guys. And if you love wine, definitely, definitely give this subscription a try. Or if you're just interested in trying it, I definitely recommend it as well. So beautiful people, I definitely want to just mention that... Having sponsors on my channel makes it possible for me to keep 
bringing you the content that you love. So by supporting Bright Sellers, you can directly support my channel. So I definitely want to mention that. And I just thank y'all for allowing me to bring these sponsors to you guys, introducing you to new companies and their products. And again, thank you Bright Sellers for sponsoring today's video. Hey, beautiful people. So I'm home from the stores. I want to show you what I bought from Marshalls, Dollar Tree, and Aldi. I did run into, oh, and also Michaels really quick. I just re returned a few things, got the money back, and then spent like $9 in there, nothing major. Anyway, so that is what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you. I just want to mention that today, hold on. So today was the last day that I drove my son to school for ninth grade he is moving on to 10th grade london is moving on to eighth grade the twins are moving on to third grade ayana is about to head off to college she has a couple more days she graduates next week my oldest daughter is also going to college she is going to school for nursing so it's a lot going on here but i just want to throw that out there like yeah school is well the twins have one more day. They technically have two more days, but they're two half days. So the last day they probably won't go. Um, but yeah, today was a, it's just an exciting time. School was getting out. I'm so ready for it to be over. Anyway, let me show you really quickly what I picked up. So I'm going to start with Marshalls and then work my way down. So I picked up this Christian Soriano necklace. It was, how much was it? Sorry guys. Trying to do this with one hand, $12.99, not that expensive at all. And I told you I really can't wear fake jewelry around my neck. So we're I'm gonna I'm try it one more time. I don't know why, but I'm gonna try it. This will be maybe for special occasion. When I'm indoors, I'm not outdoors, I'm not sweating, I'm not all of that. So we'll see. But I thought it was nice for $12.99. I also got this anklet. It was originally $12.99, I believe, yeah. And I got it for $10, so just got those two pieces right there. This is the world's best tasting gourmet gummies. <laughs> it was originally, I think it was like $10, but they had it on clearance for $3. So I picked this up, I like the store. Y'all know I like to keep stuff like this in here for the kids, it's super easy. But again, when we go on our little walks or to the park or to the pool or whatever, I can throw this in the bag with a cooler in the ice so that it doesn't melt or anything like that. And there's a little treat. I don't gotta spend a ton of money on candy and snacks and all that other stuff. So I like to buy a little stuff like this every now and then. I did get this Steve Madden purse and I love how it opens up. And yeah, it was only $19.99, a great crossbody to wear to Kennywood, or if I'm taking the girls to the park or anything like that, where I can just throw it on. It's very, very, very lightweight, very lightweight. I picked this one instead of the all black because it has gold um, hardware, and y'all know I love the gold hardware. This is really heavy too, this Steve Madden like little charm thing. It's really heavy, but I picked that up for $20. I got these two curly tennis shoes. These were both $20 a piece on clearance. $20. I did get a couple teacher gifts, so I'm going to show you that really quickly. So then I found this Teach Love Inspire. I think these were all the same price, $5.99. I got this, You're My Hero, $5.99. And then I love that you're my teacher, and this was $5.99. So I got those three. Again, it's for the math teacher, reading teacher, and art teacher. Those are the three teachers that the girls talk about the most or all the time, basically. Um, they don't mention anything else. And then also the principal, which I just need to get her a gift card. Um, but we have these chocolate, milk chocolate drenched Oreo cookies. I'm gonna throw this in their bag. And then I bought this Nikita Morphe palette. I think I showed y'all this in the store, but it was $19.99. And did I open this? I think I opened it. Let me came in bubble wrap and everything. I didn't open this. And it has like a magnetic, it has like a magnetic closure. Yeah. Morphe Babe. Hashtag Morphe Babe. Here are all the colors. Sorry for the lighting. Look at that. I've never seen the swirls. Metamorphosis. I love when they give everything a name. 
I love when the colors have a name. Love it, love it. Anyway, that was $19.99, so I'm going to put that back in there. And then I also got this Avon, this is Morphe and Avani Gray for the Bebs. I got this palette, this palette, excuse me. I did show y'all this in the store. I got the Madison Beer um, Luminous Setting Spray. This was $7.99. I'm definitely gonna tell you guys how everything is. I got this MAC Prep and Prime, and this was $16.99. The MAC Prep, Prep and Prime Natural Radiance Base. And I've never had anything MAC or any, or Morphe. I don't believe I've had anything Morphe. I've never had anything like that. So this is by Doja Cat Cloud Coat. This is in Deep Berry. I showed y'all this in the store, but I'm gonna show you it really quickly. Here it is right here. Deep Berry. I love the packaging. I love that, really pretty. And then I also got this one, which is the red. And it is a true red. Let me see if I can get that one out too and show you really quickly. They were $3.99 a piece. So here they are, side by side. So we have red and we have, what is this one? It's called Deep Berry, okay. Red and Deep Berry, and this is by Doja Cat. So I'm gonna just set those right here for now. I picked up some more shorts for my son. He loves the sweat shorts. I told y'all that, I think I told y'all that. These were originally $12.99, and it has one world with the blue and the yellow. And then it has over here, One World, Recycle, you know. And then on the back it has the flower. And then it says, the environment is where we all meet, where we all have a mutual interest. It is one thing we all share, all of us share, and which is true. So I got him the shorts right here. I know he's gonna like them, because again, he's really into these type of shorts. I picked up the twins, some more socks. You get 15 pair in here for $9. So I picked that up for them. And then last thing I got from Marshalls were these pet wipes. You get 120 in here for $3.99. And these are for the dog, the cats, and the guinea pigs, depending on, you know, if we need to wipe them off or anything like that. The guinea pigs need to be wiped off. The, I need to go clean their crate too. I'm gonna clean their crate today and maybe Leah needs to be wiped off every now and then. The cats, you know, the cats do their own thing. But one of the cats, the kids always say she stinks. So I know you're not really supposed to wash cats, but she may need a bath. She's the one who um, got out the house. I don't know if, I think I told y'all. Um, one of the basement windows was broken, so they were able to get out, but one came back in and the other one got lost and then she ended up going under the basement steps and, and hiding until we found her. Um, but she's the one that they say stinks. So anyway, moving on to Dollar Tree. So I got these four glasses right here. And then I also got these four, which are a little wider. I don't know if y'all can tell the difference. But these are for my wine tasting. Yes, yes, okay. And then I did go into Marshall's looking for wine glasses, but they didn't have any. Um, I will double check at um, Ross whenever I go there again, because I want the tall wine glasses as well, but we'll see. I mean, it's, it's not a big deal. Anyway, I got these clear bowls to for the charcuterie board, as well as um, like if I'm cooking or something, and I want to put the ingredients in here until I buy some glass ones from like Walmart. I didn't see any at Marshall's either, so you get four in here for $1.25, I just picked that up. I got the teachers some bath bombs. This is lavender, this is strawberry, and this is cotton candy. I got three cards, they were 50 cent a piece, and whoa, 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 let me show you really quickly. So we have this one that just says, bless you, and it said, the Lord works wonders through wonderful people like you. Thank you. And I was just looking for thank you cards because, of course, the Dollar Tree is not going to have teacher cards. If I would have went to Target, that would have been different. I honestly did not have the energy to go into Target. I got this one. Give and it shall, it shall be given unto you. Good measure, pressed down and shaken together and running over. Luke 6, 38. 
and then it says pray and the lord blesses your giving heart in abundant measure and i'm going to give them a little note as well i'm going to say a little thank you as well and then the last one is this one it says thank you nice things just seem to bloom from you thank you so much and all of the teachers have been amazing i will say that they have been amazing the girls only have positive things to say about them and i'm very happy they had a very good second year they had a really 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 good second year so that just makes my heart smile i got them some mint um, gloss and it just says this is meant to be i actually have this upstairs in my nightstand for when i want to put some on my lips and it does it's very minty i really like it it's <laughs> it's one of my favorites um it's macaroon shaped here it is i started to get them some macaroons from marshall's too anyway i got them some hyaluronic skin cream and then i also got them the warming eye mask and i bought myself one of these as well i will be doing a um like a skin care night routine with me. I bought a few things. I'm just gonna add that to it where I am just pampering myself. And I think I'm going to do that the next time. Well, I, that'll, I was gonna say the next time the twins stay the night, but over someone's house, which can be, that might not never happen. Anyway, I'll do it very soon. You'll get that very soon. And that will probably be on my vlog channel, just so you know surprise blind balls i got these for london and the twins just something that i'm going to give to them because they like little stuff like this i got these little pans because when i made my cornbread in the round pan i just like the square pans better i want to buy next time i go to um walmart or target i'm gonna buy some square pans that i can just that are not disposable and then i also bought the white bags again they didn't have any other they had a lot of birthday bags so then at Aldi, I bought some extra sharp, extra sharp white cheddar cheese. It's already sliced. I bought some Gouda, already sliced, some club crackers, the round crackers. I bought the panino tray. And then I also bought this cauliflower dip buffalo style. And I bought some bite-sized dry salami. And that is what I bought from Aldi for my charcuterie board, for my wine tasting. Yes, yes. And then from Michael's, I told y'all I took back, um, I got about almost $50 back and really didn't need anything from Michaels. I'm very proud of myself. I literally said I was gonna be in there like for like seven minutes. I might've been in there for like six, okay? I was in and out, in and out. No, maybe let's say like seven to 10 minutes. I was in and out though. So I got these flowers. They were $1.99, but you get 60% off. So they were $1.19 and I got five of them. And here's like a better look. Wait, that's not the best looking flower like this. Um, I did tell y'all, I don't know if I told y'all, but I do have 90% of the stuff needed for my office. I have a brand new rug. Um, what else? I'm going to keep those curtains. I'm just going to wash them. And I need to get a curtain rod, which I will do. I think I have one though. I think I have a brand new curtain rod in the basement. I'm gonna check. So I don't have to buy anything. And um, I have some other little home decor accessories to kind of, you know, jazz it up and make it look a little bit more decorated, but also functional. And I don't want to tell you all of that. I'll just, I'll give you a haul when I do that video. But I've been collecting stuff for that so that I can get that video done for you guys. And not only get it done for you, but just get it done for myself. I'm really, really ready to utilize that space much more. I also got these. And... These are called, um, they're just spring picks, basically. They're just spring picks. And these were $3.99, again, with 60% off. They have like the white little tips right there, like they're about to bud. And I just bought three of these. So I think I have, you'll have to see, I don't wanna tell you. Just know that that video is coming. I'm slowly getting that together. Not slowly, because like I said, I think I have about 90%, 95% of everything that I need to get that done. The thing that's going to take me the longest is organizing the space. So that is everything that I got from the stores. Also, I do have my dress for Ayana's graduation. I will probably wear that jewelry, some of that jewelry, yeah, for her graduation. Um, I think our graduation is at like 9 a.m. It's super early. Um, anyway, so I'm going to put this stuff, get this stuff put up. Also, I'm going to show you how I make the 
teacher bags. Let's get that done so that they'll be ready. I can have them on the island. We can grab them and go for tomorrow. And then I'm going to do a little bit of cleaning. Now I'm about to clean up the kitchen. It really wasn't that bad. I definitely needed to clean my stove. I cooked the day before yesterday or the yesterday. I can't remember which one. Anyway, I cooked on the stove and <laughs> it just needed to be cleaned. Yes, it needed to be cleaned. Other than that, it really wasn't that bad. I went to Sam's Club and I went to BJ's. Um, those videos will be coming very soon. And that's why you see all the snacks and everything. The kids actually the last day of school was today basically and they have a half a day because it is actually going to be 95 degrees today hot as ever hot as ever anyway i'm going to clean up the kitchen this is the chips um bin right here and as you can see they had some open pretzels in there so i got rid of that and added the extra chips and stuff in there i'm going to sweep i was going to mop but i didn't get to mopping this night and that's okay but I'm going to sweep really quickly and get the rest of this cleaned up. Yes, and I'm feeling good because the house hasn't been too messed up. You know what I mean? Like there's things that are out of place and, and such. But for the most part, the house has been okay. We've been trying to stay on top of it. I've been trying to get the kids to stay on top of it. Of course, I clean up every single day. I'm always doing something. So yeah, this was pretty simple. And I'm actually going to heat them up. Some leftovers I made beef tips mashed potatoes and i made corn and cornbread the day before so still had some leftovers there i'm in love with all your lights and your colors i'm in love with all your nights but you've kept me far away from my focus and to my heart I cannot lie Stars made of stars Up above made to fall Stars counting stars And they guide me through the dark Lonely days left in despair Air is getting heavier but I do my best to breathe Dreams of green and filled with this Life is so much more than this Here we have the stove. I'm gonna get this clean really quickly. Let me give you a close up. You see that? Yes. Now let's get this clean. of you are going to come for me in the comments talking about why am I using paper towels 
I already know y'all are coming for me, but it's just so much easier, especially when I had all of that. I would have had to do the rag, rinse it out, do the rag again, rinse it out and so forth. I don't have time for that. I love my paper towels. I know some people say it's a waste of money, but again, I am a paper towel lover. I love my paper towels. I love things for the convenience, okay? I'm a convenience person. I get, my time is so precious. There's only so much. I'm working full time. I'm trying to do YouTube and trying to take care of these kids. Also, I'm about to, well, I'm not even going to go there, but just know that time is precious and your girl was just trying to get it done. I love for my stove to be clean, but I'm not trying to spend 18 bazillion hours on it. I'm not, I'm not doing that. So yes, don't come for me in the comments talking about why are you using paper towels because your, your girl got other things to do. <laughs> So now I'm getting ready to empty the dishwasher and I'm actually going to wash some of the dishes that were in here. Sometimes, you know, if you don't lay them in properly and so forth, they don't get as clean as you want them to be. Now, I know for a fact that little Chris loaded the dishwasher, so that's why things weren't as clean. I'm very particular. Like, I know that's why that's one of the hardest things for me, guys. I think I have a little touch of OCD. Again, I know y'all probably don't believe this, but when my house is out of order, I am so upset and so drained. I cannot stand for it to be out of order. I cannot stand for things not to be done, and I like things to be done a certain way. I want the dishwasher loaded a certain way. I want the dishes put up a certain way. I want the floor swept and mopped a certain way, and I have to you have to relinquish some of that when you are teaching your kids how to clean and so forth. You, you have to let them do their thing. You want to tell them how to do it, but you have to let them do their thing and then go back and correct them in a very positive, nurturing way. I know all of this, but in my mind, I'm like, oh my gosh, why can't they do it the way I want them to do it? Even with, with Big Chris, he used to say that <laughs> to me as well too like I'm like why can't you fold clothes the way I fold or why I used to show him how to fold clothes all the time or different things like that why can't you do things the way I do it and we are all different all different the kids they have a mind of their own we are all different I know this um, but I'm just saying when my house is out of order when things are not in the right place when I have a ton of laundry a ton of dishes or whatever it 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 does something to my soul, to my spirit, to my mind. I, it doesn't sit well with me. So even though I may be tired as heck, I still want to get things done. And sometimes I am too tired to get things done. I am human, guys. After all, I'm human. 
So anyway, I'm just putting things up. I'm going to eventually reorganize these um, cabinets again and so forth because it's not the way that I particularly want them. But I'm going to wash these dishes and yes, finish doing what I need to get done in this kitchen. Sometimes I But it's all I have You know if we could run to a place where we belong But I need you there with me to go on The stove is completely clean. I wiped off the front of it as well. I'll probably clean the inside soon, but now I am just going to wipe off the top of the sink, get that all nice and clean and shining and sparkling, and then I'm going to move on. But I like to get this done as well. You know, after you get done cleaning all your dishes, you wanna make sure everything is nice and clean. Size, like even when I die, I'm a ride for the squad, let her ties in the hearse. I've been on the vibe, kinda hard to describe. I'm in between I'm good and it's fine, but I'm tired of the grind. Then I come alive in the night to realize I'm in the middle with a time of my life. I'm never so packed for the stack, never lied on the back, got a bag from the way that I write it. Queen looking Tyson, do that ass survive, doing 80 to the house, then I hit it to the sky, change haters on a tire. Young 
Tell me reckless gold in my soul got the same on the necklace
beautiful people, the kitchen. Well, beautiful people, the kitchen is done. Yes. We have everything laid out for our wine tasting. We have the teacher bags that'll go out tomorrow. Yes, wine tasting. We got a candle lit over here. Smells so good. I am definitely going to be cutting those watermelons over there. Sink is clean, my lunch bag is drying, so I'm just gonna leave that there for now. But everything is done, put up. Now what you could do is wrap this in saran wrap, put it in the refrigerator, have it chilling, waiting for people to get here, things like that. But yeah, everything is good to go. Everything looks so nice. Definitely time for a wine tasting. I wanna thank Bright Cellars so much for sponsoring today's video. Thank you, Bright Cellars. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Thank you so, so much for watching. I will talk to you guys in the next video. I love y'all to the moon and back. Bye.